What's going on everyone? Today we're going to be talking about the Fishing Derby, which is a little bit different than previous expansions where you can not win and still get prizes. So that's pretty sweet. This is where the Fishing Derby is in Hollow Fall and it is right here, the Hollow Fall, Hollow Fall Fishing Derby. You have an hour to fish up your quests and you get this buff that uh, allows you to fish up these trophy fishes and by catching all three fishes you do get a total of 25 derbies. Those derbies can be used for quite a bit of things uh, like transmogs and uh, recipes for fishing. Also they do have these uh, fishing pools so seeking seeker thread and angular thread and in doing so, it increases your fishing by one uh, on each of those for a total of a hundred. So very nice. Uh, also, they do have things like soaked journal entries, which can be used to increase other your fishing on other characters. And you're able to uh, get these little recipes, like I said, that sell for quite a bit. Pep in the Step sells for 10,000. Uh, Rock Slide Shake sells for 12. The Melted Candy Bar sells for 5 Ghoulfish sells for 30 uh, I will have to obviously check these. I think these are outdated, but uh, yeah, they are there. Uh, as far as how to actually do the Fishing Derby, well, it's very, very easy. All you have to do is collect the quest, and we'll start doing it now. So I do have my Fishing um, Seeker on, I guess, and I can go to these different fishing pools. The main two are Blood in the Water and this Calm Fishing. So we will be doing this Derby so we can get all three. And then as time goes on, uh, oh, we already got one. Um, as time goes on, then as you can see, we just got a Derby right here for collecting a unique fish. But we need to go fish Blood in the Water and various other fishes. Um, and another Mark Derby. So as you can see, I do get quite a bit of Mark Derbies to really, uh, well, there's, there's two already done. So I think, I think the last one, there is something making a lot of noise. I think it's this guy. Um, the Azkaha Slum. I think those dropping the fish, uh, those drop in fish in the uh, blood in the water, and I don't know why I keep missing the fish because I think there's I'm paying attention to the sound instead of each of these fish. So, um, I'm gonna find I think it's blood in the water, the last one that I need to find to complete this quest. So, we'll just do that. The major two or three, I guess, is calm in the water. Um, Blood in the water, and then uh, the last one I believe is. I don't know. I finished it though, but now I, I can just fish for the next uh, hour essentially. So I have this buff that allows me to catch the trophy fishes, but it also, while fishing and catching unique fish, I do get marks. So that is a good thing. Also, Blood in the Water catching these slums do sell for about 600 gold so uh, each so uh, not too bad the harmer fish sells for 50 and these uh blood perch sell like for 18 oh 27 so fishing is pretty pretty decent for uh, farming obviously you still i find mining and all that to be a lot better but yeah this is uh, how you do the fishing derby it's already done um, I could just go turn it in and get my marks. But I usually just go through here, this channel, go through here, go through the side, go down here, and another pool. Just go right here and fish. So if we go like. Boom. So that's how you do the fishing derby. It's really, really easy. 
like I like I literally did it within three minutes um, and completed it. You might not be as lucky, um, but I mean that's really how easy it is. I fucked that up. I usually push the, so I have a better fishing. And it's a one uh, one button push, so that it interacts with my. Um, I guess fishing rod, and I just need to push one button when I hear a sound. And so also fishing in these uh, fishing pools do give you, like I said, these derbies. Ten derbies actually give you uh, a a uh, thread, and then the better perception you have, the higher rarity of fish you get, um, like these spectacular rainbow fish sell 40 gold. Um, and then I have some good buffs like the, the, the ghoul fish, Delight, helps with uh, perception and a bunch of other things. Um, this helps with increased fishing. The other ones help with increased perception. You can get crusty, crusty dark moon cards. You can get transmogs. All sorts of fun things. So as you can see, just got some more. And then the cache is here. So we can go find that. There it is right here. So I'll probably drop around here and get some free bloody tokens and some other things. Maybe a recipe that I can sell for 20 or 30 gold, 1,000 gold. So I'm going to see how that looks. I'm already capped on my uh, conquest and bloody tokens. So I can't get any more. But what I can do is get uh, get some free loots. Boom. So there we go. I got 150 honor, 60 conquest, and bloody runes. I'm max on these, so I don't get any of these. I do get honor, which is not that great for me. Um, and then I get some field badges, which are like $20, 20 gold. So uh, not too bad. And then you can just go back to fishing and uh, you know, just enjoy your day. So I also found that if I go over here, oh no, there's a, sometimes there's a deep, I think it's called something deep in the water. Um, where you can fish transmogs out of, so um, explore the deep or something. I don't know. Let's see if they have it. It's a new thing. I don't think I've seen those tidewalkers before. There's another one, a glimmering pool that you could fish out of. But that's about it, guys. I just wanted to share that with you. I'm not going to actually do any more. Um, boom. So I'm done. I still do keep my dashing derby i believe if you do turn it in you can still get the marks i've gotten marks outside of uh the actual day um also i think you do get marks from having a higher perception and then also having um fishing in the pools during the tournament i believe if you fish here oh see so i do get still marks for f fishing up these little uh things also, like I said, these minnows, these minnows do get perception and all sorts of stuff. I will be doing a video pretty soon here, how they nerfed the Awoken um, fish, which are right here. So I'll go over that here in an upcoming video. But that's it, guys. Remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.